he was the type that if somebody bothered you and he loved you and he was with you, he going all the way for you. You know, he wasn't just out here wild and things like that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, New Orleans was full of guys like him, you know, that had that temperament. You know what I'm saying? I mean, and, you know, he was known for, you know, it was different. Sometimes you have rappers that rap and talk, talk, talk this life or whatever, and they really wasn't that bad in the hood. They wasn't they wasn't a coward. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't, you know, with him, it was like he talked it, he rapped it, he lived it, if need be. You you catch my point, if need be. You know, he wasn't out there. He was he was somebody that if, if you and him was walking down the street and it wasn't his beef, but he with you and somebody disrespect you, he he jumping first. You know what I'm saying? And he gonna keep going with it even if you like, Man, I'm I'm man, I'm I'm good with it, you know. He was like, Nah, that's and that was him, but he was a humble, good family good son, good brother, good friend, you know, good father. You know, he was a good dude, you know, and, and people, like I said, try to label him as this super, super thug, like he was thugging all day, every day, you know what I'm saying? Trust me, you know, he had his moments of, of, of relax and fun, and he was a funny dude. He, he'd make you laugh, you know, you know, but he was a serious dude when it came to if it was an issue. You know what I'm saying? And, and and he had an army behind him because he would go down for them. They would ride for him just as much as he's going to ride for them. 